Do you think Canada is a united country? I think it is divided in a lot of respects because politicians and various levels of media um, get mileage out of leveraging that division. I don't think at our cores we're any more divided than we used to be. But there's a lot of levers that are being pried into those cores to wedge us apart for short-term gains, which turn into long-term setbacks. Yes, sure. That's I actually I migrated here from my home country, so I know the place is safer, much more safer than the many countries of the world. So it is also united, and um, the freedom is there. Freedom of speech that I am t talking to you, uh, is there, and freedom of uh, citizens is there. So I like it, and this is a great country. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think Canada's a united country. We've got petty squabbles, what I label as stupid stuff. I, I really don't think we have any major issues that we can't talk about. Uh, politicians try to make something out of a particular issue to get elected or to talk to their base or whatever they think they're doing. And it's it's annoying, but I think Canada is quite is quite united as a country still. I think that we are moving farther and farther apart. Unfortunately, I think at the root of Canadians, I think if, if we were able to talk to each other outside of the polarities of uh, progressive and conservative labels, I think we would find that our values are actually probably a lot closer. I think that we, sh we still share a lot of the same values. I'd say I used to think so more than now. Um, I think the pandemic brought up a lot of division that we didn't realize was there. And I think that we've always prided ourselves on like Canada is supposed to be like, you know, the stereotypically kind country. And I just think that we still have a lot to work on. No, not at all. I think we're kind of going more towards the way of the US where, waiting for that motorcycle, um, where there's like two sides, like you kind of saw with the trucker protests, there was like a very divided nation. So I think we're worse than we were a couple of years ago, for sure. I wish it would be. I hope it will be at this point right now. Well, there's a lot of outstanding issues there, but in the end, we always will. be. I'm trying to be very uh, optimistic about a lot of things. Yeah, you know, I, I'm mixed on that one. I think there's a lot of great national uh, patriotism within our country. Um, we have the pleasure of uh, traveling coast to coast. We actually have a home in Nova Scotia, and so we get to see kind of the true sides of things. Uh, I think Quebec always seems to be a bit of a wild card. Um, but it feels more united now than it has in the last 20 years, I would say. I think the pandemic has brought people, uh, sadly, closer together in many different ways. Um, and other events like the recent one in the hurricane out in Atlantic Canada, you know, you've seen a huge outcry and support from across the country. So I don't know, I'm feeling pretty good about where we sit. I don't, I don't get the feeling of unity in this country for some reason. Maybe it's because of the size. I mean, we're so different from one coast to the other. I mean, I've traveled to other other countries where they're where they're smaller. They seem to be more united than, than we are, especially particularly with Quebec. And they are always one, even though it seems to be now in the past, it still still lingers that possibility that in the future they might want to separate. I, I never I never got that feeling from any other country that I've been in. To tell you the truth, I think overall we are. Uh, I think the. COVID-19 actually was a good test for that. We tended to be quite united uh, for the most part. The, generally, the, uh, the sort of uh, people against it were generally on the fringe. So, yeah, I think that we're generally united, um, but we do squabble a bit about the little things. As united as any other country, we have our differences and let's relish them. And uh, that's the best answer I can give. We are together. We're Canadian and proud of it, mostly. Yes, I do, generally. I think the things that we saw in February, the protests here in Ottawa were, uh, okay, they're in indicative of a certain percentage of uh, uh, you know the population that think a certain way, but far from the majority. And I think, uh, yeah, Canada is, is a united country. We're a diverse con country, a lot of different uh, uh, points of view, but when it com push comes to shove on the larger issues, yeah, we're a united country. Oh, absolutely. Uh, you know, there are 
people that disagree with other people and the way things are done, but uh, there are a lot of things that bring us together, you know? Hockey is one of them, and sports, you know? But uh, overall, the majority of Canadians, uh, I think, are, are united together. I, I think there's a lot of different opinions and hopefully people can respect differences without um, conflict. It's becoming less so. I think that the uh, I think that the Trudeau government has alienated Alberta, and uh, that's a very bad thing.